Valdosta State cheerleading team is made up of 28 members, including 24 female cheerleaders and four men. The co-ed squad is active year-round, cheering at football games and basketball games, and also competing at collegiate-level competitions. We were able to follow up with this team's hard work over the past season. Coach Ariel Harmon has coached at VSU for three years, and she was able to tell us how she prepares her team for the National College Championship. A lot of people think that the Valdosta State University cheerleaders just cheer at the games, basketball games and football games. Um, there is a, a huge responsibility that comes along with being a VSU cheerleader. Um, they have to do a number of appearances, they have to do um, of them are you know in their majors so it's really difficult. A lot of these students also have jobs um, and on top of that we also do fundraising and we are competitive so um, we travel to different competitions and we compete um, against universities all over, the, all over the United States. My name is Collie Ward and I've been cheering for six years, but this is my first year at VSU. Our coach is really expecting us to go out there and hit a perfect routine. She's not expecting us to win. Of course she wants us to win, but she's really expecting us to go out there and um, provide good feedback for our school and just hit a perfect routine. We're a really strong team this year. We have our moments, but it's just because we care about each other and we want everyone to do their job good, but we went kind of a different route this year. We have a different style of cheerleading and I actually think it's going to pay off this year. My name is Shannon Larry and I'm a cheerleader here at Valdosta State University. Being a cheerleader here, it's a lot of work. We have to prepare for the biggest competition of the year, which is College Nationals, NCAA College Nationals. And it's in Daytona, Florida. And for Nationals, the first day is called Prelims. For prelims, you practice a 45 second cheer to get like the crowd involved. You have certain stunts you can do and a lot of rules you have to follow. Then as soon as your 45 seconds is up, you have to stop and you have 30 seconds to get all your prompts off the floor and move to side and ready to start your routine, which is two minutes and 15 seconds. To prepare for this, we work like stunts and tumbling all the time. We practice in the mornings, practice again in the afternoon. We have to go to extra classes to work on the personal skills and get ready for the competition. We've been working really hard this year and we hope to bring home the win. Competing next in the small co-ed two division from Valdosta, Georgia, let's hear it for Valdosta Seven, State three, University. One, two, Together!